woman walking down the street, pretty woman, the kind I like to meet, pretty woman. I don't believe you, you're not the truth. No one can look as good as you. Mercy. Pretty woman, stop a while. Pretty woman, talk a while. Pretty woman, give you smile to me. Hey guys, I'm Vasco and today I'll show you how I'm playing Oh Pretty Woman by Roy Orbison. That's a classic tune. I'll show you how I'm doing it four half steps up than the original. Uh, so if you want to play along with the original, you can just put a capo on the fourth fret and play the same way that I'm about to show you right now. But for this tutorial, we're doing it without a capo. High G string ukulele, let's go. All right, the tricky thing for this song is that it changes the time signature on a few different places. I'll point them out, you just try to remember them, okay? So let's first go through the intro. We start with four slaps on your ukulele without any tone whatsoever. Just the rhythm. And it is in four fourths, this thing. But then when we start to actually play, we go in three fourths. And I'm grabbing the chord of C7 and I'm playing here C, C, E, G, A sharp on the A string first fret. And if we count it, it's one and two and three and one and two and three and... I'm doing three slaps on the ukulele after that, all right? Two times this thing. And then we actually go to four fourth and we start the same way. But here we reach to the fifth fret, third fret, first fret. Okay? One and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and. And basically, everywhere that we see in the song the chord of C7, we are playing this thing. Let's see the parts. So right after the intro, we go to the part A, which starts with the chord of F. Pretty woman to the chord of D minor. Walking down the street again, F, pretty woman. The kind I like to meet, pretty woman. Here we go to B flat. But here the tricky thing is that we have one, four, fourth. One, two, three, four. And after that we have two fourths, one, two, going to C, okay? So, let's try to count it. Pretty, one, two, three, four, 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 one, two, one, two, three, four, one, two. We stay on C for four beats, and then we do the C7. Going to the second verse. So after the second verse, we go to part B, which starts with 
B flat minor this time, okay? Pretty woman to E flat. Stop a while. Then to A flat. Pretty woman to F minor. And again, B flat to E flat seven this time. Okay. And A flat for two bars. And on the second one, I'm doing this. While I'm grabbing the A flat, I'm just with the pinky right here on the sixth fret, then releasing it to the third fret and then E string. Okay. Then we repeat exactly the same thing, but we just keep the last bar of A flat, okay? Pretty woman, yeah, yeah, yeah. Pretty woman, look my way. Pretty woman, say you stay with me. And here immediately, we go to the part C. We start with F. Because I need you to D minor. B flat minor, I'll treat you right to C. And then again, come with me, baby, D minor. B flat minor, be mine tonight. And here immediately we go to C7. And right after this part, we go to the last verse, which is also the outro and it changes a little bit we start the same way pretty woman don't walk on by pretty woman don't make me cry pretty woman don't walk away yeah. okay if that's the way it must be okay I guess I'll go home now, it's late There's tomorrow night, but wait What do we see? Is she's walking back to me And if you want to be exact, after the B flat we're doing C for 11 bars Then we have 2 bars or 8 slaps on the ukulele and then we start the same thing as the intro in three fourths. And then we have nine bars of the C7 pick. And on the 10th, we finish on F. But I guess it's more important to actually say the story and just be a little bit more liquid with the way that you're playing this. The important thing is that on C, he thinks that she is walking away. And then he say, oh wait. And on oh wait, you start giving the tempo for the intro. So the story is basically more important here than the actual measures. Uh, so feel free to do it your own way. Well, I guess that's it. That's a pretty cool song. And actually, I've never heard anybody doing it. So yeah, it desperately needs more covers. Do the song a favor, do yourself a favor and go play it somewhere. I hope you have fun. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure you hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, request songs in the comments below, and I'll see you on the next one. Bye.